Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome to the Champions Rumble Season 6. And here we go, people. This is a team-based season, and we compiled, holy smokes, six elite teams. And we are now putting these winners who have won previous Rumbles leading up to this final point here. We are putting them all into this champion's ring right here, right now. I cannot wait to see what happens. And it's the last man standing. Whoever is still in there at the bitter end will get their team the ultimate victory as we have a night of champions being displayed here in this beautiful arena. So we've got Team Heyman. Holy smokes. Team Paul Heyman. We've got... Team USA, Team DX, Team DC, Team Action Heroes, and a loyal subscriber of mine, Matty Ice. The Team Matty Ice, the Iceman in full effect. But coming in at one, we've got Aquaman rolling in, representing Team DC. And they slipped in late, brother. They slipped in way late into this final matchup as they won the last rumble and it was superman who took them right to the top but leading off it's going to be aquaman i got a funny story i went with my wife to go see aquaman <laughs> we went to see it in 3d and you know it was a fantastic movie brother i enjoyed it from bell to bell and there was a moment there was a lot of action and then it went from action really loud scene to super quiet and i went to her went to my wife and i said this is ah, uh, and then all of a sudden it went to a quiet scene and then i went awesome and then everybody in the theater looked at me and i thought they were all going to come at me or i thought i was going to get bounced out of the theater but it was a weird transition it was so loud and i'm like this is ah, uh, and then i went really quiet and i went some very embarrassing but anyway let's move on you know what i just buried my head in the popcorn sipped on my coke and i was good to go brother and then once it was over we bolted out right away anyway Number two, rolling in at two. Cue the music. Here we go. The legend, Kurt Angle. You suck. You suck. You suck. Kurt Angle. So Kurt Angle is representing Team USA. Gold medalist. And you know it's wild. You know, wrestling is the best when it comes to sports entertainment. Always keeps you on the edge of your seat. Very interesting from the 80s, 90s, 2000s, and so on. But this guy wasn't acting when he won a gold medal. And, like, you got to hand it to him. To be at that level, to win gold, to be the best in the world, and then to transition into wrestling, sports entertainment, and be at that high level, this guy is... <laughs> Say what you want about Kurt Angle. Don't call him Kurt Hennig. But um, Kurt Angle is just a phenomenal individual, man. What an athlete. But here we go. He never faced off against Aquaman. Here we go, Champions Rumble. Season 6, and he just got clocked. Aquaman, but then Aquaman. Wow, on the receiving end of a forearm. So let's see what happens. I want to tell you guys, I like this zoom-in view for these key moves that I kept it here for this Champions Rumble, but uh, here we go. Oh, nice job there. Almost looked like a makeshift rock bottom. So who's coming in at three? Let's see. Let's see. Oh, Steven Seagal representing the action heroes. So Steven Seagal, look at this. I am the greatest Shiang Guru of all time. When I ask for a steak at a steakhouse, they say, how do you like it? I say, you already did it how I like it. Raw in its form. You know, they say, respect the bean. I say, respect the beef. Eat it raw, folks. You'll thank me later. But let's see how he does, man. <laughs> Seagal. Oh, getting measured up. Here comes Billy Gunn. Representing D-Generation X. Oh, right into the steel pole goes Kurt Angle oh wow and I'm telling you this is a prime time juiced up Billy Gunn oh my gosh man let's see how he does here going with the right hands oh what was that 
It was like kind of a glitched out move there. I don't know who was on the receiving end of what. But this is the champion's rubble. Man, it kind of kept coming quick, man. I got to say, man, as I'm stuttering over my words. It came quick. Here comes Paul Heyman. Paul Heyman representing Team Heyman. And he's coming in. Like I said before, fresh off of doing P90X. He is looking like he's in the best shape of his life. Wow. And he slammed down Aquaman. And now Heyman going right back after Aquaman. He's like, I didn't like your movie, brother. I'm going to make you pay. Oh, but Aquaman didn't like it. So let's see who's coming in now. So right now we've got five guys, and I'm not talking about the burger joint, but um, we got five guys, and here comes OG Matty Ice. I want to send out a huge shout out to my good buddy Matt, who um, created a team just for this season, and his team actually won a rumble, and now they're here looking to claim it, and this Matty Ice looks like a juiced up macho man, yeah. Let me tell you something right now, I love my juice, Minute Maid or whatever. But I like orange juice, yeah. Helps you when you're healthy, helps you when you're sick. Vitamin C, the place to be. I love the killer bees, yeah. Let's see how he does though. Matty Ice, here comes Rambo. Oh my gosh, so this is the action hero. So you got teams of five. Six teams of five. And um, right now we have two action heroes. So Steven Seagal and Rambo are on a team and what I'm gonna do is I will post the teams in the description um, for you guys to follow because it's, it's sometimes it's tough to follow brother oh no Heyman and now we're gonna see the first elimination no way and here we go we got another guy coming in here don't tell me we're gonna see Matty Ice done oh Matty Ice gets a break oh here comes Superman and Superman Wow, he had, uh, no pun intended, a Superman-like effort in the last one, taking his team and willing his team to victory. And he came in pretty early, and he's coming in early now. Is he going to get rid of the Shihan Guru? No, Seagal's still in there. Oh, nice DDT. And now, this would be crazy. I am the kryptonite of Superman. Oh, oh wow. Ferocious clothesline by Seagal basically turning him into a pancake there but luckily the turnbuckle saved Superman from getting eliminated right there so we still haven't seen an elimination this is high level stuff man you're dealing with winners here brother you're dealing with teams that have already tasted that beautiful sweetness of victory so it's going to be awfully tough to eliminate these guys and speaking of oh no Billy Gunn is done and how about this Paul Heyman is stunned what happened with Aquaman and Heyman they were working together and I think they bumped heads or something they are both stunned holy cow it looks like Aquaman has the little edge there when it comes to recovering what a move there and now all of a sudden Superman is he gonna make quick work of Heyman no he's not and now this is what I was saying brother that I've created these teams I've created these groups I've increased the loyalty at max. And sometimes, brother, or more than sometimes, they work against each other. They should be working together. I'm talking about Rambo and Seagal. They're on the same team. But it is what it is. As right now, you got Aquaman. Aquaman's kind of been taking a beating, though. He's been kind of taking a beating. But I like what he did, kind of swimming his way to the side. And now, there's some beef. There's some ongoing beef here with teammates because Seagal and Rambo are fighting it out and now Matty Ice oh what a right hand don't call him Balboa that is Rambo well, that's a nice job there but these guys are working tooth and nail brother to stay in this rumble there are no more uh, second chances here here comes Road Dog Jesse James representing D-Generation X and I wanted to tell you I tried to get China in here to represent DX but I couldn't find a China that would be allowed to face the other. Oh, no, there goes Eamon to face the men. So um, I apologize about that. But, oh, Matty Ice is cleaning house. And what is this? Don't tell me the shenanigans. No, Superman. Superman. Oh, he got flipped over. And what happened to Angle? Kurt Angle 
No pun intended, brother, but he was on a bad angle right there on the side, and I think he jumped ship. He was scared. I got to go check the replay on that one after the fact, but what happened? And now Seagal could be done. Seagal is done. Matty Ice is cleaning house. This madman, biker for life. I'm telling you, somebody's got to test this man. He is now. I've never seen a guy clean house like this. And he still is looking pretty good. Rambo coming to his feet here. Rambo a little hesitant. Oh, that was a feeler kick right there. That was a feeler kick. And now, are we going to see Rambo done? Oh, my gosh. Who is going to stop this man? Who is going to stop this man in six seasons of doing this? We've never seen a guy clean house like this. And I got to tell you, the big show is being represented or is representing Team Heyman. Team Paul Heyman here. And now could Aquaman. Are these guys going to... It's going to be... Oh, this is smart moves. Trying to eliminate the most dominant force. Oh, no. That is a smart move by two crafty veterans. They saw what was going on. Here comes Shazam at 11. They saw what was going on with a guy that was so dominant. And Matty Ice refuses to bail out of here. And that is uh, that could be a turning point in this rumble. Unbelievable. Team Ice. <laughs> that was that was the captain too. That was unbelievable, brother. And now you got Shazam. Oh, see, look at this. Shazam and Aquaman are on the same team. Take out the big man. Take him out together. Oh, there you go. Big shot there. Here comes Ladies Man Smooth. This is another guy from Team Ice. Team Matty Ice's team. And he's coming in. And this guy could go size for size with the Big Show. And already the Big Show. Oh, I was going to say that was wishful thinking by the Big Show. Holy smokes. Oh, what agility by the big man. And now he's going after Aquaman as well. And oh, Shazam's trying to get a piece of, wow. But I'm telling you, the ladies man smooth. He's trying to take on all comers. And here comes the OG Big Daddy Ice. And this is another one of these guys coming in at 13. The only downside, look how big these guys are. The only downside is it's not even halfway through the rumble and there's three of them already uh, have entered, you know what I mean? So they are going to have to stand in there for quite some time. I think they got, what, two more entries to go. Let's see who's it gonna be, but here comes the big man. Oh, nice counter elbow. And now they're working together against the big show. Stone Cold Steve Austin re representing Team USA. I was going to put the uh, Lex Luger. Remember the Luger that uh, the WWE was trying to push to be like the next Hogan? Um, but I wanted to keep Stone Cold. A lot of people in the States just love Stone Cold Steve Austin. You know, and I thought it's only fitting, oh, that he can come in here and represent Team USA. But I'm telling you, Big Show's in, in some trouble. Stone Cold, he's, he's got a lot to work with here. He is going to be up against it, against this massive, this massive dude, Big Daddy Ice. Here comes Triple H representing DX. And this is Triple H in his finest form. All muscled up, and he's going right after Matty Ice's team here. But now he's a little hesitant. He's got to go after the guy in the corner. But now, I'm telling you, here comes the teammates working against each other. Shazam! Gets flipped over. Aquaman, he's killing his team. He got rid of Superman. He got rid of Shazam. And now, oh my gosh, don't tell me Stone Cold's going to be done. Oh, he's still in it. Here comes OG Sweetness. This is wild. This is wild how Team Matty Ice's team is coming in all together. Now, this is what I would say. It should be them working together, all three of them, taking out the other three. That's my uh, thing, brother, with this game. That when they're talking about teams working together in the Rumble, in this situation, it should be a six-man matchup. Three-on-three -three battle, you know? But now they're working against each other. And here comes the Big Daddy Ice. Could be in some trouble. Here comes Batman. 
<laughs> representing Team DC. Now DC, I think that's their second last entry. Their last entry is Robin. And Robin is the weakest out of all of them. So this is kind of unfortunate. If you're a DC fan, if you are rooting for Team DC, they have come in a little on the early side, brother. But um, they still have a chance. Aquaman at one, still in there. This is just so cool to see. And he's taking his time. He's taking his time, kind of flying under the radar, not doing too much. And here comes Soul Man Kareem. So Matty Ice's team, this could be all of his guys, have invaded the Champions Rumble. This is like NWO. <laughs> this is kind of awesome that you've got one, two, three. You got four out of the five members all in the ring. And let's see what's going to happen. And they are tough customers, brother. Obviously, they've won a previous Rumble that they were in. So now that you have the force of four in there, things are looking good for Team Matty Ice, I would say. Unless some of these guys get eliminated. But the one thing I'm worried about, though, is the teammates working against each other, you know? That's one thing. I know I'm repeating myself, brother, but back to the action. You got Aquaman could be in some trouble. As this is just... I just can't believe that... We're seeing four guys on one team coming in there. Oh, the ladies' man smooth on the receiving end of a beautiful move there by Stone Cold Steve Austin. And now Big Daddy Ice going after Stone Cold. He didn't like how his teammate got hit with a shot. And now Batman going with a nice little suplex. And now Team Matty Ice, they're fighting against each other as these guys working some good things here. And now Stone Cold, oh, nice job. And look at Big Daddy Ice just chilling out. And is Aquaman going to get another elimination? Oh, nice reversal. As Batman now working on Triple H. Batman working on Triple H. Oh, a little stunner there. And speaking of stunned, Batman is absolutely stunned. Oh, his OG sweetness on the receiving end of a move there by Aquaman, oh, Spine Buster. Oh no, and there's an elimination. Big Daddy Ice eliminated one of his teammates. Oh, that is not good, brother. That is not good as Triple H now trying to work against this unbelievable YouTube team. And are we gonna see Triple H? Oh, he's done. Triple H is done. And now we are down to five as Stone Cold working it. And sweetness is done! Oh my gosh! And now you got the ladies man smooth with the OG Big Daddy Ice. And after all that happened, when the smoke has kind of settled, well it hasn't settled completely, but just a little bit, you could see through the tunnel, brother, through the pathway, two members are done. And now, don't tell me the big man's done, they're only down to one guy. And now Stone Cold, is he gonna do the unthinkable? He's gonna close out this team as Aquaman is done. And Matty Ice's team is done. Unbelievable drama. As here's CM Punk representing Team Paul Heyman. As he was managed by Heyman. Let me know when. But I cannot believe what happened with uh, the Ice Ice Baby team. They are done. Oh my gosh, brother, I cannot believe this. But now there's three guys in there. The rumble must continue. There's always drama in the Champions Rumble. It can never be a smooth <laughs> finish, but that's just how it goes, brother. Makes for great entertainment. Here comes Brock Lesnar representing Team Paul Heyman. Now I'm looking. Paul Heyman's team. You had uh, Heyman was in there. Lesnar was in there. The Big Show, Sam Punk is in there. And I think there's only one more guy remaining, and that is Roman Reigns. I think it's just Roman Reigns. So let's see what happens, brother. Let's see what happens. I want to thank you guys so much for being here. I didn't even say that in the beginning. Thank you so much for all the support as we are moving into the tail end of this. Here comes Duggan. Hacksaw Jim Duggan getting a nice number at 21, representing Team USA. So let's see how Duggan does going after his own teammate. I think now when it comes to the Champions Rumble, 
These guys, brother, these guys want all the glory, all the fame. They don't want to work together. They want to be the guy that's going to have their hand raised at the end of this. And it just seems like it's individuality that's going on here in this Champions Rumble. So let's see what happens here. Nice job there by Stone Cold with the reversal. Here comes X-Pac representing D-Generation X. And now, how about this, Lesnar? Wow, Lesnar almost got undercut there by X-Pac as X-Pac was trying to get in the ring. But now, you got Stone Cold oh, on the receiving end of a combo there by Brock. Oh, nice move by X-Pac on CM Punk. CM Punk trying to roll around there, trying to get free. And this is a, a downloadable CM Punk. And how on point is that CM Punk? Very, very good, man. It's, here we go. Who's coming in now? Who is coming in now? Anybody's rumble. Indiana Jones representing the action heroes. Now with the action heroes, man, I think this is only their, this is their third entry now. This is their third entry. They get two more guys that are still scheduled to come in here. We shall see who is gonna come in. There's a little shake up on that team. There's a little shake up on that team. So uh, Bolo Young is not on <laughs> the Action Heroes. Is are we gonna see Lesnar out of there? Oh, Xbox help him, help him out. Brock Lesnar is done. Brock Lesnar is done. Here comes Roman Reigns at 24. This is the last member of Team Heyman. It all comes down to <laughs> the dude at the head of the table. <laughs> Roman Reigns. Let's see if he's going to reign supreme here. Unreal stuff as he's going after Batman. It feels like Batman has been in there forever, brother. It feels like Batman has been in there for a long, long time. He has been. He really has. But let's see how he could do. Nice job there. Slowing down Stone Cold. And Stone Cold, man, somebody's got to get that guy a Gatorade, man. He's in a full lather. He is sweating up a storm. And he is just looking to just kind of get a break here. But Roman Reigns isn't giving it to him. Sending it to the corner. Oh, there goes Hacksaw. So that's a member of Team USA is done. And oh, Stone Cold still in there. Fighting tooth and nail, brother, to stay inside this thing. And now let's see what's going to happen. Who's coming in now? Oh, Bruce Lee. Bruce Lee. Why does it say slash UFC? Oh, <laughs> Bruce Lee's got the <laughs> UFC attire on. He's ready for Conor McGregor. Oh, my gosh. So he's part of the action hero team. But Bruce Lee came right in there. And he got clocked with some shots by Roman Reigns. And nice job by CM Punk. But CM Punk is part of that team. The Paul Heyman team. But he, oh, he decides not to go after him. But he's going after a member of Team USA and Stone Cold Steve Austin. Stone Cold could be done. He gets flipped over. And he's done. Stone Cold, man. He just needed time. He needed time to break. Here comes Robin. This is the last member of DC. And I'm telling you right now, I'll lose my mind if Batman and Robin start teaming up together and win this Rumble. I will absolutely lose my mind and go bonkers, brother. Come on, Batman, you gotta get up. Remember as a kid, I remember as a kid watching Scooby-Doo and seeing cameos of uh, Batman and Robin. They would appear on that show and I could never understand it, but I think the artist um, did both of those shows. But uh, I was so shocked as a kid. I'm like, why am I seeing Batman and Robin on Scooby-Doo? Did that really happen or was, was I just dreaming of that? Let me know in the comments, but, uh, <laughs> or am I not uh, recapping my beautiful nostalgic memories as a kid properly. I don't know, brother. I don't know, but I gotta go check that out after. Also, I'm gonna be completely embarrassing myself, but that's all good. That's all good for your entertainment. So here we go. Who is coming in now? Who is coming in now? The Patriot at 27, representing Team USA. Wow, the Patriot at 27. Now with the Team USA, I'm just looking right here. Holy smokes, you got Angle, the Patriot, Hacksaw, Stone Cold, and I believe the Hulkster is still yet to come in. 
So the Hulkster, if I did it right, is still yet to come in, but we shall soon see. Whatever happens, if there's a mistake, that's just how it goes. Wow, nice little, that was a great, what was that, a neck breaker right there? A stunner. But um, we'll see what happens. Sometimes in the game, you set the roster and it doesn't come out as you set it. Man, we've had that before, especially in WWE 2K22. It would be glitched out sometimes. Remember, remember that for all you OGs out there when I did that NBA Rumble? Michael Jordan, who's the greatest basketball player of all time, was supposed to come in. And I think Yao Ming took up two spots. I couldn't believe what happened. But here we go. Look at this. This could be a shocker. This could be a shocker. Whoa, CM Punk. You're not eliminating Roman Reigns like that, brother. You're not eliminating Roman Reigns like that. And now Bruce Lee and Indiana Jones fighting against each other. Here we go. Are we going to see... Bruce Lee done. Bruce Lee gets flipped over by Jones. And he's done. Oh my gosh. That is so sad, brother. That is so sad. And how about this? Robin Hood eliminates X-Pac. And Indiana jo Oh, come on. What is Robin? Robin, what are you doing? Don't call him Robin Hood, brother. Robin. What is he doing? No. The heartbreak. And Roman Reigns giving a swinging neck breaker there on Batman. Like, come on, brother. You got to be working together. You got to be working together. And now Robin could be done. Robin in the corner. Batman in the other corner. Robin gets flipped over. And now don't tell me Batman's going to get flipped over. No way, Batman. Staying in there. So now. Wow, long delay on who's coming in now. Long delay. Let's see. Three, two, one. It's Hogan at 28. So now you got the Patriot and you got Hulk Hogan representing Team USA. And that is it. You got one member of DC and Batman. You got Paul Heyman. Look at this. <laughs> that was a great move. Paul Heyman's team representing, represented by CM Punk and Roman Reigns. The action hero, Indiana Jones. Oh my gosh, brother. Here we go. Let's see what happens. Champions rumble in full effect. Oh my gosh. Here we go. This is number 29 coming in. Number 29. As Hogan already coming in. So here comes Michaels. DX. They still got a chance. So you're saying there's a chance. Yeah. Now this is um great stuff for Michaels. Michaels got to use his agility. He's got to use that agility. And keep things moving. He can't stay stagnant like this. He can't stay stationary, which is going to allow these big competitors to pick him up and kind of toss him around. Oh, <laughs> down he goes. And Michaels, that's not the entry he wanted. That's not the entry he wanted. As Jones now in the corner. Here we go. This is the last guy. Jean-Claude Van Damme representing the action heroes. And there goes Indiana Jones. So for, for the... Action Heroes, it's only Van Damme left. Can Jean-Claude do it here? As Van Damme with a nice little mushroom cut. He's got the uh, he's got the attire from Bloodsport. Come on, brother. You could do it. Now I break you like I break your friend. Oh, here we go. Is the Patriot going to be done? Hogan just staring at him and he looked away. What a job by Punk. And now Hogan looking to get all the glory. Oh, doesn't eliminate him is now Batman trying to go after the Hulkster. Oh, oh, that was a nice little jumping, spinning roundhouse kick by Batman. Batman showcasing his uh, Taekwondo skills, man, the kicking. Taekwondo, man, I'm telling you, kicks were the best. I took Taekwondo, got a blue stripe, brother. And um, it was tons of fun doing it. I should have continued on. I should have continued on. Biggest regret. But anyway, forget about that. Here we go. Oh, nice job by Van Dam. Reversing. Oh, Shawn Michaels. And what a job by Hogan. Dropping the leg. Now Hogan's got to act. CM Punk is stunned. But Van Dam is a problem. And Van Dam, he's got the strength. Maybe not the strength to... You know, face off against Hogan, but he's got the complete package to give Hogan problems. And now, how about that? Van Damme doing the right thing. Curling to the side. And now, are we going to see Michaels? 
Don't do it. Oh, Hogan. Whoa. Wow, what speed. Did you see how quickly Shawn Michaels went from left to right there? That was wild. And how about this? Teammates fighting it out. Ultimate heartbreak. Oh, Hogan setting it up. Hogan setting it up. He dropped a leg on him. Michaels is in trouble. But decides to go after Roman Reigns. This could be a mistake. This could be a mistake. And is he going to charge forward? No way. Roman Reigns says no way. As we are down to, look at this. One, two, three, four, five. The final six. The final six. Now Hogan on the offense. Oh, nice hip toss by Michaels. Michaels with a beautiful hip toss. And then he goes with a nice drop kick there on Van Dam. But he just seems to be in the line of fire here. This is tough stuff. And nice job by Batman staying with it. Staying with it. And now Van Dam. Oh, oh. Wow, I'm telling you, Jean-Claude is in some trouble. Oh, man, nice clothesline there. And now Roman Reigns. Uh-oh, Roman Reigns got to be careful. Roman Reigns is done. Shocker in YouTube land. And now could, don't tell me. Oh, no, there goes the Hulkster. Oh, no, he's still in it. Hogan survives the sweet chin music. Hogan survived the sweet chin music. I cannot believe that just happened. Not every competitor could say they could be on the receiving end of a Shawn Michaels kick and still be walking around. And Hogan, Manny, what a chin on Hogan. And now Hogan, <laughs> he dropped the booty on Van Dam. Oh, and now Michaels. Oh, Michaels got to be careful. Oh, no. There goes Michaels. We're down to the final four. CM Punk. Van Dam, Hogan and Batman, Champions Rumble Season 6, what's going to happen? And now they're working against him. This is smart stuff. When they see a guy that's dominant, these competitors here in this Rumble have been working together when necessary. <laughs> what a move by <laughs> Batman. And now Batman with the right hand. Hogan now trying to, oh, he's trying to slow down. This is a smart move by Hogan. Trying to use a little technical wrestling here to slow down Batman. He's like, not so fast, brother. Not so fast. This is my house. I helped build this company. And now I'm going to show you who's the boss. One of my favorite shows growing up. But anyway, here we go. This is it. Nice job by CM Punk. CM Punk's doing the same thing. I feel like both Punk and Hogan feel that technical wrestling is what's going to slow down Batman. When it's a slugfest, when it's a street fight, you're never going to win when it comes to... Batman, but if you could just be technical, work on those limbs, um, good things are going to happen. And now, how about this? Are we going to see Hogan out of here? This is going to be huge. Another shocker. A CM Punk is doing the unthinkable. Oh, I'm going to lose my mind. Oh, is he done? He's not done. Van Dam. Man, it didn't look like there was a lot of steam on Van Dam's kick. Oh, nice perfect plex there by CM Punk. But now there's Batman still in there. <laughs> Batman. <laughs> oh, nobody moves there. Big chop. And now, oh. Wow, Van Dam and Batman working on Punk. Double DDT. And now they're working against each other. Don't tell me. Don't tell me. Don't break my heart. No. And now we got the final two. Batman. Looking at the crowd saying, give me some love, brother. It's Batman and Punk. I don't think they both kind of have the same amount of health. And now they're staring each other down for all the marbles. Team Paul Heyman. Team DC. Champions Rumble Final. Here we go, brother. <laughs> they both botch it. <laughs> they both botch it. But Batman has a little bit of the edge here. And he's throwing him out. Batman has sealed the deal in the Champions Rumble. Oh man, this is wild as all the glory is now going to Team DC who came in late. They came in late to the party, but they are the last team standing. And I hope you all enjoyed season six of this team-based rumble. Teams of five, it's great to be alive. Oh yeah. But here's the thing, man. They're going to enjoy this victory. But let me know what you want to see next. Season 7 is kind of up in the air, brother. I'm going to be honest with you. I don't know what to do 
and the people that are going to drive Season 7 is going to be you at home. Yes, you staring at your device right now, brother. It's going to be you. You let me know what you want to see next. And let me know your thoughts on this very emotional Champions Rumble. Thank you so much for the support. My name is Ricky J. I'll catch you next time. Much love.